So Chrissy can go first if she's on the cook. So I'm going to keep him in our prayers. Uh, so to be a donut at breakfast. Yeah, eat a donut and then come for lunch. <laughs> beautiful day you've given us to just enjoy your creation. Lord, tonight we come with a heavy heart and bring prayer requests to you for those that we love and hold dear. We pray for Alma and her family as they struggle through the loss of Alma's son so suddenly and unexpected. Lord, just be with Alma. Be with the family as they as they are processing this and as they get into the grieving process. Just let them know that you're there in the spirit. Comfort them. Send them one of us to, to minister to them and minister to Alma. Lord, just be with Brenda Armstrong tonight and Bill. As Bill <laughs> As Bill is there supporting Brenda, give him the strength that he's going to need. Give Brenda the, the knowledge that you're there and that your plan is being unfolded and revealed. Lord, just be with her. Give her strength if she goes through the next few days. Lord, be with Shelby. We praise your we praise for her success in the in the surgery. Now we just pray that you continue to heal her and give her strength. Lord, we pray for Tanya and her ongoing health. Just be with the doctors. Just let Safi and Tanya know that you are always there. They can look to you. Whatever the times get rough. Just be with Ed as he goes through his, his health issues. Just let us make sure he hears well. Give him the encouragement and the strength that he's going to need. Just be with Billy Ray and Tina at night. Work. Tina, as she slips to where she doesn't recognize Billy Ray, you. Be with Billy Ray and give him the strength to just continue to love her. Or he's going to need all the strength that you muster to be the husband, even though he's struggling to, to keep the identity of, his, of himself as his teens. Lord, just be with Mary. As she goes through a procedure along. Lord, just keep your, your guiding hand on the doctors as they test, as they check. We just ask you to just bless her and bring her back to us healthy. And just be with Carrie. Lord, you know that need there. You just continue to bless Carrie, and she is in a very important part of our ministry to our children and to this church. Lord, we finally come and we thank you for keeping Linda safe, even though she's had a rough week, that you've kept her safe, that you've given her the strength to be here tonight, and that she can look at it as a blessing that she can still witness and testify of you. Now, Lord, as we go into our Bible study tonight, just be with each one of our hearts. Let us pull from the word what we need to go on throughout the week to bring us back on Sunday to minister and testify of your holy name and salvation. 
pray this in your holy and precious name. Amen. 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 All right. The only announcements I have. Video on Friday? Yeah. Yeah, we're doing the video that uh, Jack Hughes just recently, was a few, well, probably a week ago now, posted. It's called Where Are We? And it's really good. Y'all will enjoy it. And, and also, I posted on our Facebook page, the church's Facebook page, that we can no longer live stream to our Facebook page, our church Facebook page. Facebook has decided you can't live stream to a group anymore. So I'm live streaming it to my page, my personal page, Debbie Strickland Mitchell. If you're not a friend of mine, you probably won't be able to watch it live, but never mind, we ain't watching it at all. <laughs> Did it stop? But anyway, anyway, I'm uh, posting it to my page, and once it's up, then I will share it. I'll share the link on the church page so you can watch it, but you're not gonna be able to watch it live until I get the Everything else worked out. I understand. They're trying harder and harder to conceal the word of God. Yeah. And the harder they do it, the more God's going to bless. Yeah. He's going to make it plain. Yeah. All right. Um, also, uh, Sunday night, uh, reminder I do have, we're, we're learning the story of David in his life and how we apply it to uh, our giants in our life. And that's important because we are going to go through times like this. This is a giant, right? But because what David wrote in the Psalms, the Lord is my strength, and He is the conqueror. I think there's one other phrase we have lifted Shady's daughter in prayer, and she's doing great. I just asked you, so that's a phrase. Amen. Good point. Is there any other announcements? Yeah. Ladies, you're going to be honored on Mother's Day for the church luncheon. You better decide what you want. And let me know so I can order. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> 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 <laughs>